Let me be clear. This decision does not prejudge the Chief Inspectorate's report into incidents at Mount Eden Prison or any other outcomes or consequences that may stem from that <coughs> report. It also comes in the context of corrections stepping in to manage the prison in late July. In summary, this decision is about the safety and security of Mount Eden Prison. The Chief Executive has decided not to renew the contract and I fully support it. What this gives us is a chance for a fresh start. So what we need there is a fresh start, um, looking forward, a fresh vision um, and potentially a changed operating model for running the prison. So uh, this gets us uh, a distance on that um, and it allows us to manage a transition effectively. So it gives us 15 months to manage an effective transition. There's uh, Circo employ a lot of people, there's hundreds of people work at that prison. Um, be a tough day for them, um, you know, re receiving this news, they'll be uh, worried about what happens next. And I guess the thing we want to assure people is that prison's still going to be there, it's going to need people, um, whoever's running it. Um, what we need to do now is manage a safe transition for all of those concerned, for the staff, uh, principally for uh, prisoners, uh, and make sure, as the Minister's laid out, that um, we present a set of options uh, for Ministers in the new year about the future uh, running of Mount Eden Prison.